Hate broccoli? Is kale too bitter? You're not alone. While these veggies are good for you, some plants that taste bitter are highly toxic. Sensitivity to flavor is important for survival. But how do these sensitivities evolve? Researchers in Japan studied the taste buds of five New World monkeys to track how millions of years of evolution have shaped bitter taste sensation. New World monkeys are useful in studying taste receptor evolution because they have wildly different vision systems and diets. To see if the monkeys have different sensitivities to harsh flavors, the team expressed two types of bitter taste receptors from each of the monkeys in cultured cells and observed their response to bitter compounds. For the first receptor, the monkeys had a muted response, except for the highly sensitive owl monkey. For the other receptor, three monkeys had intermediate responses, while the marmoset responded strongly and the owl monkey barely responded at all. When did these different sensitivities come about? The researchers built evolutionary trees based on the similarity of the monkey's receptors. They then inferred what receptors ancestral animals might have had and tested these as before. This revealed that the first receptor became more attuned to bitter flavor during the evolution from its second to first ancestor. The other receptor generally stayed moderately sensitive to bitter substances, but became more and less responsive rather late in the evolutionary game. Multiple amino acid changes may have driven each case, although the scientists were able to identify one amino acid in particular that explains some of the difference behind the high sensitivity of marmosets and the low sensitivity of the other monkeys. The findings suggest that monkeys have adapted to specific environments by slowly modifying the sensitivity of their bitter taste receptors, ultimately creating their own senses of taste.